2021 will undoubtedly be an eventful year for Tesla. The company has unveiled some of its most ambitious products, with the Cybertruck being the center of attention. Elon Musk has also tweeted about the highly anticipated Tesla electric yacht, which is why to meet the demands of production, especially where its batteries are concerned, the company is building a Gigafactory on a larger scale that will dwarf its current Gigafactories by comparison. Tesla's new Terra Factory is coming up in Austin, Texas. Named Tesla Gigafactory 5, or Giga Texas, it will handle an unprecedented volume of production, 28 times more than its present Gigafactory in Nevada. Besides, the factory will also churn out the Tesla Semi and Model Y. Elon Musk says all this will be ready in 2021. Let's check out Tesla's Terra Factory, the Giga Texas. Before we start, however, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, subscribe to Tech Division, and hit the bell icon for notifications. Now, let's get into it. Tesla's new Terra Factory will be in Austin, Texas. Tesla's new Terra Factory is being built on 2,100 acres of land in Del Vale near Austin, Texas, which is just east of Austin Bergstrom International Airport. Within just a span of a few years, Tesla has unraveled some ambitious plans for electric vehicles, the best of which will hit the market in 2021 or early 2022. The company's breakthrough last year in battery technology was fortified by the construction of four gigafactories, with Tesla Nevada having the largest footprint of the lot. Tesla Nevada has a production capacity of 35 gigawatt hours, and it produces the battery packs used for the company's electric vehicles. With the unveiling of the Cybertruck, Elon Musk has hinted at the need for a larger facility with a terawatt hour capacity. That's a 1,000 gigawatt hour facility. It will be so large you could fit 28 gigafactories in it. However, with the new Texas Terra Factory, the company hopes it will be able to meet all of its ambitious goals for late 2021. The Terra Factory will cost $1 billion. Tesla's Terra factory called Giga Texas is being built at a cost of $1 billion and will spread across 5 million square feet. Musk says it will be more than just a factory. Parts of it will also be open to the public with boardwalks, streams, and hiking trails. He promises to make it a nature lover's paradise. Giga Texas has already received approval from several government organizations and even received a mammoth tax cut of $50 million from state authorities. It will create 5,000 jobs. Once completed, the Terra Factory will create around 5,000 jobs over a period of four years. The company plans to hire about 5,000 workers, with salaries averaging up to $47,147. They are apparently looking at a range of job profiles, everything from entry-level positions at a starting salary of $35,000 to more specialized positions that pay more. The Terra Factory will handle the production of its batteries, the Cybertruck, the Tesla Semi, the Model Y Yacht, and the Model 3 electric car. However, it should be noted that the main focus of the Terra Factory will be on battery production. Construction underway Construction for the Terra Factory commenced on January 19, 2021, with foundations being poured with three Gigapress high-press die-casting machines in the northeast corner of the property. Components began arriving the next day, and the first Gigapress was fixed into position. By March 2021, it seems construction was in full swing. Several areas, like the northeast corner, were already completed. At the water treatment facility, workers were spotted rolling their own metal tubes from spools on site. The internal wall of the factory has also had blue paneling installed. Several deliveries of components, tools, ducting, and framing materials have been rolling in every day, including stair sections with handrails as well. Robots have also been arriving steadily and were spotted out in the open waiting to get fitted in the robot storage. Components are now arriving. Continuing through April 14, 2021, more and more components and accessories have been constantly arriving at the facility. The roof insulation continued to expand with wall sheathing and wall installation work has been carried out in different areas around the factory. A large gas line was seen installed in the Gigapress area with backfiling going on in the excavated site to bury the pipeline. New footings are also being installed in various corners. Expansion on the south side has also continued. Steel columns were recently erected in the latest section of the site. The battery cell production area is expanding north as we speak. Electrical fencing around the electrical substation has also been completed. More substations are likely to develop as construction progresses. It will integrate Tesla's secret battery technology. 
Tesla is leaving no stone unturned to make sure its Terra factory lives up to expectations. What many don't know is that the factory will ultimately integrate Tesla's secret technology called Roadrunner. With Roadrunner, the main driving technology behind battery production, the costs are expected to decrease by $100 per kilowatt hour. As for the production of electric vehicles, the factory will have a general assembly line set up in place to assemble components coming in from other gigafactories around the world, just in time for the production of the Cybertruck scheduled for late 2021. Musk also wants the Terra factory to produce Model Ys in the same time frame, and while many feel it isn't feasible, Giga Shanghai has already begun production within a year of opening. When you've got a man like Elon Musk at the helm, nothing is impossible. Tesla's Terra factory is expected to churn out 367,000 vehicles after setup with a target of over 10 million vehicles per year. It may even start lithium mining. Where Tesla batteries are concerned, Tesla has already contemplated partnerships with firms like Canada's Giga Metals for outsourcing metals like nickel. The company is also planning to build a lithium hydroxide chemical plant that would support the Terra factory's battery operations. A big change in this regard is a place called Lithium Valley that is said to be an abundant source of the material. It lies between Oregon and Nevada. With a proper mining operation set up, Tesla's Terra factory will be more self-reliant. Of course, the big question is if there will be enough lithium available or not. Lithium is the third most common element on the planet, and with the free hydrogen chemical plant, Tesla might just tap into the resource which could have a significant impact on the Terra factory. A completely sustainable facility with the Tesla Terra factory, the company's main goal is to be 100% sustainable. Several areas will be powered by solar. Investment management firm Arc Invest has forecasted that the Tesla Terra factories will also solve the management bandwidth and vehicle painting issues. It will remove the bottlenecks in production, especially if the company rolls out its electric vehicles with the same exterior as the Cybertruck, which has no paint and is ideal for outdoor activities. We hope you found this information about the Tesla Terra Factory to be interesting, especially if you plan on buying the Cybertruck. If you want to be notified of our latest content, then be sure to hit the notification bell and subscribe to Tech Division.